So as you could tell by all that intro stuff, if you guys have been here at the channel for very long, you know what's happening. We're coming back to Lorecraft. I know I've been a long time. I never wanted to miss a week with Lorecraft, and I've missed several months. Um, this semester of school was just way more crazy than I was expecting, and it is wrapping up soon. Because um, I have weird class schedules and stuff like that. I'll explain it more in the next episode of what's been going on and why Lorecraft has been missing, but it is coming back and I know a lot of you guys are excited a lot of you guys have been asking um and I I'm excited to be back because I mean this is this is my my baby my infant child and I'm just looking around and I'm seeing how much I've become a better builder and designer and even redstoner just by looking at some of these things but I'm also really excited because I've put in so much work here like we have resources I mean this is going to be going forever we have what I would consider now really pointless farms. Like, I have a redstone block down there literally just to slow down the efficiency because it was way too fast. Um, like, it's just crazy. And I'm honestly just really excited to be able to come back. Um, we're working on the explosion village, which means, yeah, we're going to get a creeper farm in here, but not just any old creeper farm um, at the new area. Which I should probably show you guys, because you guys may not actually remember what that looks like. So here it is, and it's it's just nice, flattened out, everything like that. I was working on this before 1.13 came out, so all there's no seagrass or anything like that, and you may have saw. There's a reason why I spent so much time working here. This is a mushroom fields. That's new. Um and I'm really excited because we'll do a lot of fancy stuff here because that's an ocean so we could put a creeper farm right there and it's going to be extremely extremely efficient like um we could put drowned farms up here if we want but it is an explosion village so I don't think that would make sense but we're able to have we have some water by where the water village would be so we'll be able to do that um but no I thought I would just say next Saturday a week after when you guys are seeing this if you watch it the day it comes out we're gonna have Lorecraft back um and the kind of game plan a little bit for the time being is we're holding off on the end portal until 1.14. Two reasons. First of all, it burned me out a lot uh, working on that. But the other reason is that there's going to be end stone slabs and stairs and stuff like that, which is going to help so much with what we're trying to do there. So, so much. So we're going to hold off on that for a little bit. And we're also, we're going to stay here instead of the water village for now, just because... I like the idea of trying to figure out how to do this explosion -y thing. And I think it'll be a lot of fun. I'm really looking forward to it. And I don't worry, nothing else is changing. We're actually we're increasing video productivity on the channel because things are slowing down with school a little bit. Um and that's great. I'm going from currently like nine credits of double speed courses down to six which um might not just be a lot of numbers for most of you but it's a really big difference because it's the difference between me working 70 ish hours on school week down to 50 45 to 50 and that's gonna help a ton but no this is gonna be the area we're gonna be working i'm really excited we're gonna do some terraforming some flattening put up new houses we're gonna get our planning out we're gonna probably probably gonna do something fancy i want to do something fancy to come on back now that i know more editing stuff but you know, i'm really excited and i will definitely see you guys here next week at the start of it all again warcraft episode 60 not warcraft episode 1 season 2 because that's silly warcraft episode 60 i'll see you in a week goodbye